Northern Beaches residents are locked in a battle over development, one that rings alarm bells for suburbs all over Sydney. They say a major retail and commercial district planned for their leafy area would overwhelm already clogged roads. Whether it goes ahead depends on who wins the election. It's one of the three ways to drive in and out of the Northern Beaches when Warringah Road's actually moving. Oh, it's a shocker. It's always like a parking lot. But there's a government plan to convert a two-kilometre French's forest strip either side of the road into another Chatswood or North Sydney. The idea is to try and get uh, more jobs in that area uh, so that people don't have to travel. That's going to be 12 storeys, 12 storeys, 10 storeys, 10 storeys. At Christmas, locals were given just over a month to respond, extended later to the end of February. Why the rush, they say, before the election? Very, very angry that we can't do anything, that the government can just step in and can do what they like. Turning this bushland site into a brand new hospital supported, but opponents to the rest of the plan say it's bad news for all of the northern beaches, and this is why. To put another 20, 30,000 more cars a day onto that road uh, under this new proposal. The planning minister is promising a transport plan first. The shadow planning minister says the project's too big and in the wrong place. Whoever forms a new government, it'll be their decision. But developers are already looking for interested sellers, offering to pay their removalist costs. I think it is already out of our control and it doesn't matter how much people will jump up and down. Chris Maher, 7 News.